We come on the air now with breaking news. WBZ sources say a Waltham police officer has been hit and killed by a car at a national grid work site. Three utility workers are also hurt. Thank you for being with us tonight. I'm Lisa Hughes. In the chaos of that scene in Waltham, police say the driver who crashed then stole a police cruiser. We want to get the very latest now from WBZ's Brandon Truitt, who is live near the crash scene in Waltham. Brandon, what can you tell us? Yeah, Lisa, this is the first of two scenes that are being processed at this moment. We're here on Taunton Pond Road, an incredibly popular road here. It's just about a mile or so off the exit from Route 128. Police have been spending their time in this area where utility crews were working. And in this image, you're able to see the white truck here that they've been focusing their attention around as they're kind of processing around that scene. And there was essentially a utility uh, manhole that was cut open where crews had been working. Let me take you from the view up above. Above. Here's a better look at that truck involved in this crash and the investigation that's being done around it. This is where we are told uh, the Waltham police officer was injured. And again, those I team sources telling us that that officer has died. National Grid is telling us at least three of their workers were injured here, too. I team sources say one of them has very serious injuries. From here, state police say that driver of the truck stole a Waltham police cruiser and then took off. Now, the chase ended about a mile away with. The crash at a dead end road. Neighbors who heard all of this are stunned. And when I look out the window, a cop car like flew by about like 85. I don't know how fast, but very fast, like much faster than like usually you would see a cop car driving. I was just out front, out the window, and I just heard a big bang. And all I saw was the uh, um, cops just arresting the guy, hit my neighbor's truck. And again, you're seeing the work that's being done here at this white uh, truck, at this uh, where this crash originally started before that driver, we are told, stole a Waltham police cruiser. Now, when the driver crashed, we understand that he tried to run away. Police were able to arrest him, um, but state police, the Middlesex District Attorney's Office, all investigating this, an incredibly fluid uh, situation in terms of what they're processing here. A lot of stake with just a tragic series of events. We're live in Waltham. Brandon Truitt, WBZ News. All right, Brandon, thank you. This is